Well, hi everybody, and today we're here in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee, and we're here at Dream More, and we're gonna go in and we're gonna try the Song and Hearth restaurant. You ready? Ready. Let's do this. Let's do it. I have actually been to Dream More quite a few times, but we've never ate at the Song and Hearth. We're gonna head into Dream More itself. Um, got a little, well, waterfall off here, but let's go in and check it out. head into the song and her. Moonshine jars make a picture of a barn. Barbecue chicken. Fried chicken. Collard greens. Macaroni and cheese. Ooh, waffle fries. They even got grilled cheese. Can't go wrong with that. Barbecue ribs. Green corn. 
Yum, looks good. <laughs> Mashed potatoes? Mashed potatoes. Make a salad first here. Nope. Oh, okay. And um, put some of this on here. Are these dandelions? <laughs> Here's all the salad sides here. All different kinds of feta cheeses. So I uh, fixed myself a salad here. So did you get yourself a salad? Yeah, I had to wait. Yeah, I got one. Well, the glasses are mason jars. That's cool. They actually got stone soup. Dolly Parton stone soup. What kind of potatoes then, are those? Those are marrow potato. Baked? Oh. I'll, I'll have hickory smoked beef brisket. Stone soup. <laughs> Pizza. So I got ribs, barbecue chicken, pulled pork, and then there's actually some prime rib down there. So Dawn, you went back and got what, pizza and a little bit of salad, right? They got this old fashioned donut station. You actually pick your donut and then you can put different types of toppings on it. And then they got Ooh, some, some cobbler. Got these little little pies and brownies. And, well, they got a gluten-free station, and then they have a sugar-free station. What is that? Like a pound cake or something? We got some cookies. I haven't tried it, but tell me the table did better. Oh, wow. Okay, so I got myself some homemade cobbler, a brownie, and this little, like, cream pie. Yeah, for dessert. Well, here's a plank from Dolly's first stage, which was her front porch in her Tennessee mountain home. Dolly dreamed she would, well, be a star one day. And then this chest nut box here is, um, it's actually got some wishes for the future. And I hear there might be a song that she might have wrote. And it will be opened on Hunt, Dolly's 100th birthday in 2046. Well, a room filled full of Dolly Partons. <laughs> Actually, they're all her albums throughout the years. She's had a lot of albums. I see a lot that I remember growing up, what have you. It's a nine to five album. I remember that movie. It was a really, really good movie. Of course, you got the Coat of Many Colors. This is one of my favorite ones here. Dolly Parton's Tennessee Mountain Home. Old Dolly and Kenny. It's Sylvester Stallone. <laughs> I like these curtains. From a distance, they look like butterflies. They really do. But they really don't represent uh, a butterfly. And over here, well, this is like the elevator of the banks. Of course they have a spa in here and uh, it's currently closed but we could take a little look. Ooh, Dolly Spa. Dawn, do you want to have a, a spa day <laughs> at Dolly Spa? Well this is really cool, you can actually see 
the Dollywood train and and Dollywood. Ooh, cinnamon bread. But if you turn this way, ta-da, Dollywood, da -da 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 Dollywood. Dollywood might be closed for the season, but we can get a little bit of Dolly while well, here at Dream More. Well, being here tonight is making me miss Dollywood. Yeah, only about a month. Or pool, a game room, a camp, Dollywood, and a fitness center. Well, while we're here, we might as well check out at least the pool. Look at there's actually butterflies on the carpet here. Of course, this is the their rooms. And uh yeah, so it's just like your your basic hotel. Looks like they have a an ice machine and a um, Coke Coke machine, but it smells like a hotel. Looks like a hotel. A game room here for the kids, and then they got a fitness room. That's cool. And then this here's the pool. Yeah, nice pool. So here's Camp DW. I guess it's the place where you know you can drop your kids off and they have activities and, and what have you. Oh, they actually got a, a character artist. Well, you can play a game of little checkers or tic-tac-toe. Well, this here says authentic Dolly Parton instrument made out of Swarovski crystals. Ooh, you see that, Don? And on the other side of the plate, fireplace, they have another one, too. And, um, what is it, a mandolin? And it just says, authentic Dolly Parton instrument made out of, well, Swarovski crystals. They got a little cafe in here that actually got well, they actually got a Starbucks. You can even purchase your Dollywood tickets or Dixie Stampede tickets or what have you.
uh, Dream More was crazy. Of course, that special was bringing folks out. Now, that special that we had is only for Sevier County residents. And it's something that they do uh, during January and like the first week of February. So it doesn't last that long. Uh, yes, and so it was buy one, get one. And it's a great deal. It only cost us, uh, well, about $26 total, right? And But normally it would have been 48 And uh, so 48 would be kind of pricey, especially for us. But I guess if you're out in a hotel like that and you know maybe you can splurge so don what did you think about the hot the song and hearth i thought it was good food it was all you can eat you can pick and choose whatever you wanted yes a wide selection of food yeah um i love the ribs the ribs are really good i love the uh beef brisket was really good um everything was really good um i had that uh that cobbler Ooh, wow the that cobbler, was, cobbler was the bomb um, the only thing I didn't like was I actually went over and tasted what the kids menu was, was like the, like the grilled cheese and, and that just wasn't good. It was kind of hard. Uh, but other than that, everything else was great. So they set us in the bar area and I didn't like that because there was like folks just like congregating around in there waiting to be seated because it was just extremely busy. And uh, so it was hard. People were like staring at us eating. I was trying to vlog. There's a lot. Of, it was just loud in there. A lot of people were just talking. Um, I walked around the main area and I loved the architecture in there. It was really, really nice. Had a, a like a farm, um, you know, feel. Uh, they also had Dolly Parton stone soup. You guys, everybody know that Dolly always tells a story about uh, stone soup. They actually had that in there. Uh, the stone soup, I don't think it was as good as I thought it would be. It was more of like a, like a, like a... Kind of like a cabbage, cabbage soup to me. It vegetable. Like, yeah. Yeah. It was um, very bland. You just had solid pepper with it. Yeah. Um, what else was there? Um, yeah, so it was good all the way around. The service was a little slow because, no, there's just, just packed full of people. I imagine any other time of the year, it probably wouldn't be as packed. Um, so yes, I, we had a great experience, um... And um, would we do it again? Uh, we'll do it again for uh, two for uh, two for one, right? Yes. But you know, forty eight dollars for all you can eat buffet. Uh, there's some other places in the area where you could do a lot more for forty eight bucks. But um, I did get my dolly fix uh, between the season here, so we're about a, uh, you know a month and a half away from Dollywood opening. Oh, Dream More itself as a hotel. What did you think about it? It's a Mac went. Yes, very nice hotel. Um, I like how they had the butterflies on the floor. And in the lobby, they had some Dolly Parton um, personal effects. Of course, they had that box in there to open up on our 100th uh, uh, birthday. And I guess there's like all kinds of stuff in there. It could be even a new song. I think it's supposed to be a new song. A new song or something. I heard different things about it. But that's really cool, too. Mm -hmm. And, um, yes, yeah, so we got to walk around. Um, and see Dream More in the grounds it was really, really nice. There's a lot of butterflies and stuff. The pool and, and all that looked great, too. And um, they had a place for eating roast marshmallows and, and what have you. So, yes, it was great. Also, that fountain. Did you see that fountain, Dawn? Yes. It was froze <laughs> over. It's beautiful. And it was, it's even more attractive now yeah, with ice. Yeah. So, guys, that was great. Well, that's going to do it for tonight here, well, in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. And if you like this vlog, give it a, a thumbs, thumbs up. up. Also, if you haven't, please subscribe so you don't miss any of these upcoming, well, Smoky Mountain Adventures. And until next time. Thanks for watching. Good night, everyone. Bye, everybody.